Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Renes, and today's video is going to be about a different video which is travel related. I'm going to Thailand, but throughout the journey, I didn't bring along any compact camera with me. There's no vlog for this whole trip, so I thought of filming some travel related video for you guys. It's all about like packing, how to pack your travel makeup bag. If you are interested, just keep on watching. At first, this is my travel makeup bag. As you can see, it is so big. It is like twice of my face. Oh, this is so heavy. This bag is from Naraya. This is my favorite brand for makeup bag. It is a Thailand brand which I bought last year. It is so huge and it can fit a lot of things inside. Opening up, you can see I put a lot of things inside. I will take out one by one and explain to you what I bring in this whole trip. First of all, I actually pack all those toilet trees inside this. Okay, uh, this is from 23. Whenever I buy the spot red, it will come with this plastic, like sealable plastic that can be reused. This is so much convenient for traveling. This is my shampoo. This is my go-to shampoo from Caffeine. Caffeine. Uh, this is the shampoo and this is the conditioner from their new Restore series. So when it comes to traveling, I would choose those products that make me confident. Some of the products are really needed to be tested if previously I go for traveling because I want to make sure that my skin condition is best during the trip. Moving on to the shower cream. This is the shower gel from the body shop. They just put all over the, their counter so I can easily grab one. To me, for shampoo, it is not necessary to work best as long as it cleans up my body and that's it. I have nothing to be really care about uh, body wash so I just pick whatever that it convenience for me to bring along. This is the one. And this is a toothpaste from Sensodyne which I get it from my dental clinic. A small tube which is enough for two person. And also this is my, <laughs> this is just a bottle from the body shop. This is actually my makeup remover. So it is a makeup remover from Paradiso. Black Rose Makeup Removing Lotion from Paradiso Garden. So I just pack it in a small bottle to easily bring along. Moving on to the face wash, I actually bring these three little tubes from Innisfree. Oh yeah, from Innisfree. They are so cute. They are from Olive series, from Jeju Volcanic Pore series, and also from Green Tea series. And because for the whole trip, two doesn't have to use the same face wash. I just get it. it's not enough for us, so I bring all three along. This is from their sample kit. Like whenever I purchase until a certain amount, like 120 ringgit, they will give me this sample kit, which is so cute. And this is also the reason why I love Innisfree. They always give some sample kit for their customers to try. Customers like us get to try different kind of product before deciding to purchase any products in big bottle we as customers would know that uh, which kind of product is suitable for our skin I need to shout out to this olive real cleansing from this is so good because I like the foam the texture of the foam the foam isn't so fluffy but it is compact a thick quality foam that you use to cleanse your face. The moment is just so silky, smooth, awesome. So here is my toilet tricks. Okay, moving on to skincare. First, this is my beauty lotion, like toner. Uh, this is not from ERH. I just use the bottle. For eye cream, I'm bringing this. The green tea seed eye cream from Innisfree. It is so small in the tube. 
which is very 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 travel friendly. Oh, and this one, Shiseido Ultimate Eye Power Infusing Eye Concentrate in a Sample Kit for my pimples, for my chica. It is called chica, <laughs> and also Innisfree. I will bring this Bija Chica Balm from Innisfree, seven ml in a tube, so small. For serum, I will use this Whitening Pore Ser Synergy Serum from Innisfree and also this Whitening Pore Cream. These two are from their VIP kit. Throughout the day after I use these two, they give me the effect of instant brightening after a few days of use. So incredible. So I'm very confident with it. So I bring this along. And this hand cream from Innisfree also. This is Peony hand cream. I love Peony scent to the max. So this one is uh, just for in case. Uh, during the night, staying in air-conditioned room, I scared my hand feel dry. And the last one, this is from my birthday kit. <laughs> this is Orchid and Rich Cream, which I will put on my face during night time. It gives me enough moisture. I'm bringing along this capsule recipe pack in case I need some sleeping mask or a quick moisture. Yes. This is my Oral-B Glide Pro Health Deep Clean Floss. Okay, I want to shout out to this floss. This floss is so soft. I like those floss that is hard and uh, when I want to floss my teeth, those floss just, uh, when it touches my gum, it feels like a real floss thing, it feels like something. But this doesn't. This is just as soft as seamless. This is my go-to, especially when I have my braces on. It's like everything, everything I eat will stuck inside my braces. I need a thorough clean up at the night. Oh, and also this. This is my lip mask from Laneige. This is so, 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 so useful. It moisture up my lips uh, and then when I remove it the next morning, I feel like my lips are moisture, are pampered, especially in air condition room. I don't know how chap will my lips be, so... This is the cotton pad that I use for putting on the toner. So this is from Muzi and this is from Ordinary Brands which you can get in supermarket and this is normally used for removing my makeup this is for putting on my toner now moving to my makeup this is the foundation that I bring along which is from Maybelline it is their Fit Me foundation it is a matte foundation give you a perfect cover throughout the day so I will bring this this is the brow palette from Maybelline that I always use in my previous video. You may be questioned that, huh, a brow powder will just like slow down the speed of makeup. But then I feel that I am kind of skillful with using this, with playing this, because I play this for like less than 50 times. But I'm confident with it. I can do a quick brow using this palette. So I bring this. Okay, for eyeshadow, I actually struggle a lot for the big palette i just like kick them out okay i won't choose those big palette that i can't bring along my space is limited so i will pick some small palette i actually think of colourpop eyeshadow palette but that one doesn't have a really complete cover so i thought of bringing these two would be safe the first one would be this one ultimate multi finish shadow palette from NYX as you can see that there are four color options for me to choose if I want to go for nude eyeshadow I will choose these two if I want to go for orangey look I will choose these and if I want to go for purple I will choose this and also from Innisfree this video is not sponsored by Innisfree so I have this two little sponges brush so this is my customized palette so I customized it with some colors these two colors are from their Christmas collection which is inside this one and the other six you can find it at their shop so for this trip I plan to do some Korean makeup 
with this hair color I thought of bringing this orangey, pinky and nude warm shades for the whole trip For blush, I picked these two Okay, this is from their Christmas collection Okay, together with the eyeshadow that I mentioned just now And this one is 06 This is the blush that never feels this can be natural when you put it light on your face and also can be really significant on your face like put like few layers and this blush has a shiny little survey whenever I put on this orangey blush it can be a little highlight for my face most importantly they come with this mirror mirror is very important for a girl you know my go-to contouring kit this one from Opio. It has a warm contour. This one darker is for the cheekbones. This one is for the nose shading. And also this one is for the highlight. The highlight isn't that sharp. But it the highlight is like a low profile but shiny. This one. This one is very suitable for daily. For the powder, bring this one. Fit Me Porcelain Press Powder from Maybelline. It has a small little mirror in it so that I can bring along during the trip. The small one is attached here. This one works best on oily skin. And the concealing feature is just so big. I just struggle a lot. Uh, there are lots of lips products that I love but in the end I will choose those lips that I am really really confident with. The first one, this is Kat Von D Lolita 2. This is a really seamless matte lipstick. It glides on so smooth, it works best in any kind of makeup. And then moving on, this one next matte lipstick for each of my lips. This one is Ruffle Trim. And also this one, Colourpop Lippy Sticks. It is Brink. It creates a matte lip. It's a darker tone of coral shade. I like the texture so much. It is so buttery and comfortable. And this one, Celeb Deep Rose from, from Paris Ink Velvet. It has a beautiful dirty rose kind of color. It works best at the inner edge of my lips. I want to do a gradient lip. This one always works the best for me. For the foundation of the lip, I will use this. This is from Shugao. They are water lip tint. I will normally use this as a base, as a foundation for my lipstick so that uh, whenever I'm preparing my skincare, I, I'm putting on my skincare, my lips isn't that dry before putting the lipstick because chapped lips doesn't make my lipstick stay so long on my lips the lip products will actually crack I don't like the feeling when I go out I will make sure that every single part of my face is in best condition I will try my best this is my ultimate goal in preparing all the travel essential items yes lash curler from cyber color there's something that i need to prepare uh, in case something happened so this is my earplug this is my little toothbrush for my braces this is for my eye in case my eyes get dry this is my tiny little perfume tube. In this tube, I got my Daisy Dream from Marc Jacob. It is in blue color. Ah, oh, this is my eye mask. Uh, I can't sleep without this. But in case I want to sleep on a plane, so I will put this. You know, I did mention that Innisfree always give us some sample. This is. Their Bija Chica series. This is their balm. This is the essence. So I will bring this kind of like sample pack because it is easy to bring and easy to be used during the trip. So that I don't need to buy another extra tiny little bottle to fill it up. So I just use it and throw it. Here, this is the sponges. This is the sponge that I use to put foundation on my face so this sponge is from Daiso so you can get any kind of sponge that you want the shape that you want from Daiso so I just picked 3 because I just have to make up for 3 days okay lastly 
Chan Chan. This is my son Kitsune. I don't know how to pronounce. From Pre C E. They are travel brush set. Okay. I put a lot of uh, pen kind of makeup cosmetic inside this. <laughs> it looks a little bit messy. In this set, I got this powder brush. It is so fluffy, so soft. Okay, and then this one is like the blush brush or the highlight brush or bronzer brush. Okay, and this one is a blending brush. This one is eyeshadow brush. It is so dense. And also this, the lip brush. I love this set a lot. The quality is so premium. And also it is spicy actually. I got this at a discounted price on their official website. Do really check out uh, whenever they have the sales because the original price costs 64 USD if not mistaken and I bought it at 44 USD it's kind of pricey but uh, the quality is guaranteed okay these five brushes is not enough remember the brow palette I bought this from Innisfree it is a anchor brush which is perfect to put some brow powder on my eyebrow and it comes with a comb and this one is the mini contouring brush Oh, I haven't used this. I thought of using it uh, in the trick. This is so small and so mini eyeshadow brush. Oh, this one is called for contouring. But also it can blend. And this one, mini eyeshadow brush. Styling. Normal eyeshadow brush. They are so tiny in sizes. Travel friendly is very important. Because you can't bring a lot of things with you. Uh, you can't bring a home with you to another country. And you just have to squeeze all the things inside your luggage. So I would actually opt for these small little sizes of uh, tools or whatever things that I need. You can see that this, the quality of the box is so premium also. Then for concealer, I'm using this. Kill Cover Airy Fit Concealer from Creole. This tiny little tube is so expensive. It cost me 50 something, 50, 50 something ringgit. But the outcome is so great. It can cover all the floor of my face. And this one, Mac. Big Magnifies Mascara from 1028. It is a Taiwan brand, so this mascara will give me some volume for my lashes and a little bit of length. For eyeliner, I'm bringing these two. This is from Maybelline Hyper Sharp Powder Black Eyeliner. It works best in any situation. It doesn't smudge at all. It is soft, it is so black, and the liquid is so smooth so smooth to use and this one from Clio sharp so simple waterproof pencil liner in brown color as because I thought of being some really natural Korean look I would bring this brown pencil liner with me it is a pencil but it glides on so smoothly this is so travel friendly this is a magic wand for lip and eye makeup remover from Too Cool for School. Oh yes, from Too Cool for School. So it is like cotton bud. Inside the tube there is a makeup remover. This makeup remover can remove all kinds of lip products. I normally put one tube inside my bag throughout the day or one or two tubes. So uh after a meal, if I want to clean up my lips, so I just use this and reapply my lips products. And also this. This tiny toothbrush, uh, it is a toothpick, not a toothbrush. With this tiny little brush and also the sharp end, as I am having braces, this toothpick is my best friend. You can pick all the veggie, all the meat, 
all the meals that are stuck inside my tea and it is disposable you can see that some of the items inside my bag isn't that eco-friendly because it is all disposable but I'm sitting of travel friendly is way more important than eco-friendly it is empty this is a bag from Naraya I love this a lot there are a lot of makeup bag in this market but then uh, I will choose to have this big spaces makeup bag because I don't like those compartments that is so inside like, like one section here one section here one section here I don't like because like with these three big spaces I can actually alter and design and customize how I put in those things so I don't really like those compartment in the middle uh, the focus at the side is fine it actually helps you to be more organized I like the pocket I like some pockets to be so in here and here at the side at the edge of the makeup bag. So here's completes the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you like this video. Any product mentioned just now, if you would like to know more where to buy it, uh, what price is it, do comment down below and I will read through and reply to comment. You can follow my Instagram and Facebook all my daily life on Instagram, especially Insta story. Recording down all the details of life has been really fun. I will use Insta story as a platform to share about my daily life. So do check it out. Remember to subscribe to my channel. In the coming videos I will do some monthly favorite so do check it out.